Hey, beginning April 4th, you can visit the Hughes Library of downtown Greenville and look at local artists' pieces of work and uh, be amazed at the local talent in our area. They're going to be on the exhibit. We've got Jed with us from the Greenville County Library System, and uh, Robert, our photographer, and our painter Destiny is here. Your work will be displayed. And uh, Jed, why don't you jump in and tell us how we can come and when it's going to happen. Yeah, absolutely. So the uh, exhibit starts this upcoming Monday the 4th and runs through May 27th mm -hmm. and is at the Hughes Main Library downtown at 25 Heritage Green Place and it's open to the public. We'll have it right there in the lobby of the library so as soon as you walk in you'll be able to see it and it's a great opportunity to see some local art. How did you pick who you were going to feature? <laughs> um, so we have an application process that's available through our website at greenvillelibrary.org. Mm -hmm. And we open up the applications for about a month. Uh, we did it in um, February this year. Mm -hmm. and we just get a bunch of applications in from artists from all over. And then we have a committee in the library that has um, some criteria that we look at. So we look at all their work. I have all the artists have to submit um, pictures of their work. And yeah. we look at those. And then we have some criteria <coughs> that we use to judge them. And then uh, we make our selections. Well, and the just ones being that chosen the alone is a big deal. Destiny, yes. you're into acrylics. Yes, sir. So Amen. I do acrylic art and then a little bit of digital. Well, good. Talk more about what you do. So I just recently started an art business back in October after going through the Village Launch um, community group. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. And so I've just been kind of exploring and figuring out and working on exposure. So. That's great. I think it's fantastic. And then you do photography. Yes. Tell us about what, what, what kind of, what's your subject? Yeah. What do you like to shoot? Well, I submitted like a couple images and three got selected for the, for the library and uh, I shoot digitally. I'm a commercial and fine art photographer and uh, these three images were like a film, so old school, let's yeah. say like four by five mm -hmm. and it's all locally what I photographed here and uh, one of the images called uh, Waiting and that was during the epidemic I photographed this. Mm -hmm. So it's like this chair but in the sunlight it's coming out of it oh. but in the back you still see the chimneys, it's like photographed in West uh, Greenville in the industrial section. Robert, so I'm cool. just curious, I know I used to mm -hmm. really be into photography. Yeah. Do you still deal with film at all? Do you still use black and white? I mean, Well, for my fine art, I love, uh, I love film. Yeah. I shoot black and white, but sure. commercially, obviously, you often do. Right. I feel like the most stressful digital. thing would be trying to decide what to submit. Was that stressful for you? And I'd be like, you know what I mean? Because you can have one thing that you right. may love, but... Yeah. So um, I originally submitted a piece that, um, that I was still working on and then a finished piece. And so the finished piece um, is actually a, a com uh, uh, I'm trying to see. Like a commemorative yeah, piece? Commemorative yeah, commemorative piece of the oh. Nickeltown community oh. and um, honoring the women that um, built the Phyllis Sweets. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, we just yeah. did a yeah. thing on them. Yeah, yeah very okay. cool. Jed, you yeah. got to meet the artists, uh, get together for us to come. How yep. many artists will be there for us to mingle and mix with? All the artists. So we selected four artists for this okay. exhibit, and all of them will be there, um, including these two next to me here. Yeah. Um, and that'll be on uh, this upcoming Tuesday, the 5th, from 6.38. There they are up there. Um, so all of them will be there, and all their work will be on display, so you'll have a chance to look at the art and kind of talk to the artists, and you can kind of find about find out about their process and their inspirations mm -hmm. and, and that sort of thing. So it's a really nice chance to kind of really kind of both see the art and kind of be involved mm -hmm. with it. Do y'all get nervous when people look at your work? <laughs> Robert, I'll start with you because it's kind of vulnerable to submit something that you like and then people may be like, yeah. Yeah, you just, you, sometimes you put it out and hope yeah. for the best and uh, put your energy in there and hopefully it works out, yeah. But yes, you, you open yourself up when you show your, your personal work, when you do Commercial work is just a different story, but yeah. your personal work, you know, that's part of you in there. So. Yeah, yeah, what do you think? What about you? Destiny? I definitely agree. When it's personal, you do get a little bit nervous. Yeah. 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 And then, Jen, finally, why was it important for the library to do something like this? You're always doing something <coughs> that's about more than just books. reading books. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, yeah, I mean, we get over a million people who come into the yeah. various mm -hmm. Greenville County libraries throughout the year. Um, and I think it's just a great way for artists, local artists, to support local artists in the community and give them some exposure um, to people who might not otherwise get the opportunity to view their work. And then it's just a great way for just to bring art and culture into, into um, you know, the lives of you know, Greenville County yeah. residents who come yeah. into the library. So I'd like, mm -hmm. I'd like to ask the artist, do uh, you sell your art? I, mean, I do. You do? Yes, sir. Where is, do you have a business? Yes, so this? you can find me at destinyfaithartistry.com. Okay, Robert, how about you? 
same here. I sell my art. You can go to my website, robertklemphotography.com. Klem is two M's. Two M's. Perfect. Yeah. Perfect. Two M's. And all their information is yeah. right there. If you didn't, you know, write their names down and go to the website, you'll you'll remember their faces when you see them out of, <laughs> yeah. out of the four. Sure. And then click on them so you can see more of the work or just go by and see them in person at the library and ask them questions. Maybe it'll help, you know, give you a little motivation. So thanks, guys. We appreciate yeah. this. this Jed, hang fun. around with them. You might become an artist yourself. I very much doubt it. <laughs> <laughs> it's not, it's not my guest. My wife will tell you that... Uh, I try and do art, it does not work out Same, well. Same, <laughs> Jen. I'm in your boat. I'm in your yeah, boat. We can still uh, appreciate it. Yes, I'm so. happy to support the arts here yeah, as much as I can you. if yeah. I can't do it myself. So. There we go. Thanks, yeah. guys. We appreciate y'all. Thank, Thank, Thank you. Thank cool. you. <laughs>